Look at this. This is fantastic. Wow. Woo! Oh my Trev. god. Not bad, right? Wow. That is wow. beautiful. When Look I at this view. Wow. Oh my gosh. Okay. Cheers. So, Such <laughs> a hard day at work, kid. But How I, did we do I it? I have more in my vocabulary than wow. <laughs> wow. But that was a lot of wine. Look at this picture. Mr. Ed and his gorgeous partner. I don't know what I'm doing there. Stop it. That was our second vineyard right there. Yeah, I'm on did. your back. That was, we were like in deep at that point. A couple of it wines was, in between. Guys, to go there, we were with two of our girlfriends, too, to be with our girlfriends so and out there. And it's just, when you're there, you're just drinking the wine and just enjoying. Natalie yeah. was working for the Napa Valley Film Festival. Her little buddy was there to just take it all in. Oh, but we had a good time taking it in. Yes. But before you got there, though, I was working. I got to interview Kurt Russell, who I absolutely see such a legend. The man, of course, knows his wine, too. He's a winemaker. Did you know? No. He has a wine called Gogi. It's Gogi? delicious. And, of course, there's Gogi, and then there's Goldie. So I found time. I found out a little bit more about their love oh, history. Yeah. Turns out their love story goes back much further than we even knew. Nice, Matt. Did you and Goldie meet on set? Is that how you guys hit it off? We met in 1966 when, when we were both working on a Disney movie. I used to watch this uh, you were dancer. I was, I was like 15, yeah. and I watched this dancer warm up. And I, I remembered her funny blonde haircut. Years later, um, we met uh, really on Swing Shift, the picture she was uh, obviously um, starring in and producing. Who made the first move? Kind of the big move? She did. <laughs> the what first did big she move? Do? She ran across the room and jumped on me. Really? <laughs> One of Hollywood's longest lasting relationships, Goldie and Kurt famously never married. 33 years later, what do you think it is that makes it work so well? You know, look, a lot of the time it doesn't work, right? And a lot of the time yeah. you're just in each other's face and you're not happy with things. I think that uh, I have no, I never have had any answers for that question. People have asked us that a long time because yeah. because in Hollywood that's, there's a bit of a fascination with that. Goldie said, like, had we gotten married, we probably would have been divorced at some yes, point. Yes, I think that's probably true. Yeah. yeah. I think I think it probably would have given us something to, to, to put our hands on that we can say, we got to let go of this. Kurt and I walked through the vineyard of Napa Valley's oldest winery, Charles Krug, established in 1861. But Kurt's own company, Gogi Wines, is much newer. Great wine is, for me, it's, it kind of falls in line with making movies and things like that mm -hmm. because it's there, it's kind of there forever. His living legacy, however, are his five grandkids. Is Goldie, does she go by Grandma or does she go by... Go-Go. Go -Go. She's, she's Go-Go and I'm Gogi. Cute. That's why I'm at, you know. That's um, why Gogi wines. That's why Gogi wines. Yep. That's Cute. what my um, that's what my my nephews, my nieces, my grandkids, my my kids call me Pa. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I'm looking into the aspects of possibly doing a whiskey, and if I do that, I may make all that pause something or other. You've got, your own, you've got like a whole other empire going on yeah. besides. Clearly, acting. I have a drinking problem. <laughs> <laughs> Goldie we said all? that. Don't Goldie, we said, all? <laughs> Goldie said that when she said when I started making wine, she said, just promise me you won't be an alcoholic. And I said, nah, I won't be an alcoholic, but I will be a wino. Then where better to be than the Napa Film Festival? After I hosted a special QA with Kurt, he was awarded the Legendary Actor Award. And it's clear why. I showed the 65-year-old actor special moments from his more than 54 years on the big screen. Big trouble in Little China, Silkwood, Backdraft. And of course, the 1987 comedy classic, Overboard. Probably the most fun yeah. I had <clears throat> um, was that picture because uh, we had our we had our kids, oh, yeah. we had our motor homes backed up to each other with a little white picket Cute. fence and some green. It was ridiculously uh, uh, sweet, you know. It was just a great time in our lives and, and um, working with Goldie, she's literally radiant. On set, Kurt was given a unique perspective. I shot the bathing sheet side oh, where, where, yeah, I, where yeah. she bends over. Yeah. I, I, my, uh, uh, Gary Marshall yeah. um, directed that movie. And so, uh, Gary, I was in the scene with Goldie, and she's in this really incredibly skimpy bathing suit. Oh, yeah. And uh, we we're just having a great time shooting that day. And then suddenly they were going to do this shot where she goes over there. And, and I, suddenly Gary just took the camera and put it in my, put it in my hands and said, This is your shot. <laughs> <laughs> so I said, I won't blow it. <laughs> He has the best he's, laugh. Good he's job. He's so fun. Like, I could have spent hours talking to him. And we talked about all of the success his kids have had in film. Also, Kate Hudson has, she basically has her own empire now, clothing empire. So he's just so incredibly proud of, of his kids and so what cute. they have together, Dokey. he and Goldie. And now you know Gogi Wines. He really knows his wine. Speaking of, we know our wines, We know too, our wines. Especially after we visited some pretty magnificent vineyards. Oh, Gargiulo. Um, all of us.
This is Chapelet right here. This is this gorgeous tent that we went up to, and that's his wife right there behind him. And we were all and his lovely wife Blakesley. They treated us to such an incredible spread at Chapelet. And look at that view. Once again, Kit, what do we say? Wow. wow. And then here <laughs> was Gargiulo. We absolutely adore April. There's April. Oh, you got to check out her skin line. The Vintner's, Vintner's daughter. daughter. Oh, I put that so on good. every morning. Woo. But look at this. I mean, just everywhere you go, this is the season to go to Napa, sort of like after harvest. Then you get the fall colors. We felt like we got a little taste of New England just a couple of hours away from us we here. We really did. It was so gorgeous. What a special, special weekend, meeting awesome people. So we I should thank it. all the, the... Yeah, thank you, everybody, for letting us into your home. Us in all of our treating us is amazing. Team.